Hello viewers. Welcome to my channel. Please like, subscribe and share the videos on social media with family and friends to support this channel and leave the comments if you want to give any advice or suggestion. Please don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get the updates whenever I upload new videos. If you need more information about any disease, medical condition, any test or medicine then visit my website www.diseasesandtreatment.com. Link is in the description below. Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Today's topic is anal cancer. Uh, but before starting, I would like to request you to like, subscribe and share these videos to support this channel. And if you need more information about any disease, about any medical condition, you can visit my website which is www diseases and treatment.com <clears throat> now we come to the topic what is anal cancer now it's a rare cancer and it begins in the small triangular glands uh, they are called adrenal glands which are located on the top of your kidneys and the adrenal glands produce hormones and the function of those hormones is that they give the instructions to virtually every organ and the tissue in the body so they are very important hormones so the, the function of this uh, uh, adrenal gland is very important very crucial uh, adrenal cancer is uh, uh, the other name which is used for the adrenal gland cancer is called adrenocortical cancer and uh, it can occur in any, there is no specific age so it can occur at any age but uh, mostly it affects the children younger than five and the adults between the 40 and 50 years of age and uh, but mostly it's aggressive uh, when found early there is a chance for cure but if the cancer has spread to other parts of the body beyond the adrenal gland uh, then it becomes challenging to cure this and uh, treatment can be used to delay the progression or uh, uh, to control the recurrence. Uh, one thing that you should keep in mind, not all growths that form in the adrenal glands are cancerous. So the non-cancerous are the benign tumors such as adenoma or uh, uh, like uh, pheochromocytoma. Uh, they can develop in the adrenal glands but they are benign which means they are not cancerous. Uh, the next thing is uh, about uh, the diagnosis so how do doctors diagnose this condition well the, the process of diagnosis involves uh, urine tests it involves the blood tests uh, to look for uh, like uh, unusual levels of the hormones which are produced by the glands in the blood uh, then your doctor will uh, advise imaging tests like ct scan or mr uh, to look for the growths on the adrenal glands and the surgery to remove the adrenal gland allows the doctors to examine the tissue of the cancer cells. So we call this biopsy. So the doctor will see under the microscope. Uh, once diagnosed, then uh, what are the treatment options? Well, adrenal cancer treatment usually involves surgery. So this way it's removed. And the other treatment options may include uh, radiation therapy uh, and the chemotherapy. Uh, so chemotherapy, in the chemotherapy, the drugs are used to kill the cancer cells. So surgery, uh, radiation therapy and chemotherapy, so these are the three important treatments. Uh, but again, it depends on the stage of the cancer and the location uh, and the grading. Uh, as I said earlier, if it's, uh, it's very important, if it's detected at the early stage, then it's easy, comparatively easy to cure. But if it's... Uh, uh, diagnosed at a stage when it has spread to other parts of the body, uh, then it's challenging. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease, any medical condition, you can visit my website which is www.diseaseandtreatment.com and please do not forget to like, subscribe or share these videos to support this channel. Thank you. Goodbye.